Hey there, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's hair care review. So today I do have a unique product. I tried this type of product one other time and it was years ago and I'm talking about a dry conditioner. So if you'd like to hear more about the Freeman's Psst dry conditioner, see it in action, all that kind of stuff, then please keep on watching. All right, so technically this is a hair care review, but I did get this at Dollar Tree. Just FYI, if you're gonna be looking for this, I've never used this, this is a first impressions, but uh, when I tried, I think it's um, got to be, I think that was the other dry conditioner I used, pretty decent, but this is the Freeman Psst Smooth Dry Conditioner. It's unscented, um, lightweight argan oil detangles in between washes, fragrance-free, which is awesome. Um, if you didn't know, um, Freeman stuff is cruelty free, just FYI, but pss, smooth unscented dry conditioner with lightweight argan oil gently conditions hair in between washes. This weightless formula smooths and detangles, leaving hair bouncy and ready to go. Water not required. Just spray, brush, and go for hair that fills and looks freshly conditioned, the perfect pairing with any pss, dry shampoo. Sorry, I know that's probably going to be really, really annoying. Okay. Shake can and hold six to eight inches from hair, lift sections of dry hair, and lightly spray from mid legs to ends. Brush and style as desired. Cool beans. Okay, so, oh my god, yeah, okay. So my hair was washed yesterday, and when I say I have combo hair, this is what I mean. So my ends, like you can tell, they look kind of dry, kind of straw-like, um, so, but Sean loves when I wear my hair down. I don't wear it down often. Let me lower you a little bit. I don't wear it my hair down often because um, number one, it's getting pretty long, which I'm fine with. I'm gonna go down to about hips and then I'll stop. And then, I'm sorry, I tried doing the middle part. I just can't do it, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry for all those youngins out there. I do not look good with the middle part. Middle parts make my nose look even bigger. So anyway, okay, so this is what my hair is looking like. It has been in a bun, so it does have some enhanced wave to it. But I'm excited to try this. I'm probably just going to use my fingers. But you can see like how much flyaways there are. So let's go ahead and try this mid links down. And I'll be honest, I never do the six to eight inches. I know you should, but. So we're just kind of doing half and half. Just finger combing it. Okay, so that instantly kind of smoothed it a little bit. Definitely didn't take away all the flyaways. I prefer that um, because sometimes like hair oils, leave-in conditioners, stuff like that, they can look kind of heavy and they can kind of bog the hair down. Um, and this isn't doing that, so. There really is no scent, which is nice. I mean, I do like a nice scented hair product, but sometimes, you don't want your hair products to conflict with your fragrance, right? I feel like I'm using a lot, <laughs> but okay. So I think I'm gonna stop there on that side. You can see the difference, a lot more shiny. Did help to tamper down um, those flyaways. Um, still have a lot of body and movement, which I do appreciate. So yeah, I like it so far. So let's go ahead. Okay, I think we're pretty good. Um, first impressions wise, I do like it. Um, it definitely added some shine to my hair. It definitely helped to take away some of the flyaways, um, which I do appreciate. I feel like you have to use a lot of product to get... Sorry, I'm holding my breath because even though it's unscented. Can't be super great to breathe. Ugh, okay. So. 
But yeah, I definitely do think it does what it says. It does help to add manageability, um, some softness, but it doesn't weigh the hair down, still leaves it bouncy and everything. So yeah, I, I think that the Freeman Psst dry conditioner I do like. Um, do I see myself reaching for it a ton? Eh, you know, I guess maybe if I use, like, I can't remember what shampoo and conditioner I used yesterday. Oh, yes, I do. I used the Dove Oxygen Moisture. That's the shampoo and conditioner I use. So that conditioner isn't super duper 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 moisturizing. It doesn't, like, leave my hair super shiny and, like, smooth. Um, but I do think that the dry conditioner did help to do that. So I do think it looks better. So yeah, I, I would use this again. I think this would be a great product um, if you are someone that uses a lot of dry shampoo. A lot of times that can dry out the hair a little bit. And I do think that this does add some more moisture and some more shine. It's not like using a hair oil or a hair serum. It still looks like natural hair. It doesn't look like I went in with really anything. It just looks like my hair is maybe a little bit more smooth and sleek. Um, like I said, I do feel like you have to use a lot of product, but you know, I do like it. I like that it still looks, it still looks like natural hair. It doesn't look like I added hair oil. So I do like it. I definitely think this is a product that a lot of people would enjoy. And I do think it's a good product. Dollar Tree, $1.25, even though this isn't a Dollar Tree Gold video, definitely worth the money. I think it's a good product and I do see myself reaching for it again. Maybe when I've used a more smoothing shampoo and conditioner or something that, you know, just to add a little bit more smoothness, but I do like it and I think it's a good product. So definitely something to look for, especially with spring and summer coming up. Um, if you just want to touch up your hair, I think the Freeman is a great product. I haven't tried anything hair wise from Freeman. So I think that's pretty cool. So Definitely recommend going to your local Dollar Tree to try to find this if this is a product that you think you would use. $1.25, good deal, and it seems like a good hair product, so definitely think it did what it was supposed to. Um, added a little bit more moisture, some shine, but my hair is still super bouncy and full, so I like it. But anyway, there we go. Um, I hope you did enjoy this week's hair care review. If you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up, share it, all that jazz. Let me know down below in the comments. If you've tried this, if you've seen it at your local Dollar Tree, love to know what your thoughts are down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do that. I do upload seven days a week all about budget beauty. It's not just physical beauty like hair, makeup, skincare. It's also home decor, hauls, um, some health stuff, weight loss stuff mixed in there as well. So if that sounds interesting, like I said, make sure that you subscribe. But I appreciate you stopping by. Another video should start auto-playing here in a moment. It might be one of mine, it might be somebody else's. But sit back, relax, and enjoy. I'll see y'all here in just a sec.